All right, please pay attention, everyone. You need to hear this. The Atom has finished scanning Alice. What did it say? Her results are identical to Quark's. She has also been infected with Radical Six. Oh no! No! What's going to happen to her? Well, like I said before, there's only one way to cure Radical Six. There's a special antiviral treatment. Do you know what immunoglobulin is? Immunoglobulin? It's another name for antibodies. Some people have antibodies that can fight off Radical Six. Those antibodies are the basis for Excelivir. Right. I thought of that too, so I went and took a closer look at them. Unfortunately... Correct. They can suppress the symptoms for a while, but they can't kill the virus itself. The only way we can help Alice and Quark is if we can find some Excelivir. But the pods will keep them from getting any worse, right? Yes. Well then what are we waiting for? One of you, grab Alice! We're going to the treatment center. What? Well, what is it? Excelivir! You found it, Sigma! That's the one thing that can cure Radical Six! Uh, why did Quark have it? Perhaps he found it earlier. We explored the laboratory. It was on the other side of the red door. I happened to notice Quark putting something in his pocket. Whether or not that was his intention is unclear. I did not have the opportunity to ask, as he collapsed immediately afterwards. It didn't feel... appropriate to go digging around in his pockets for it after that. And to be honest, it had also slipped my mind. We were rather preoccupied with getting him to the infirmary as quickly as possible. Who cares about the details? We have it! Hurry up and give it to him, Luna. Hey, hold on a minute! What about Alice? Does it really matter if she goes first or not? Um, I'm sorry, but I don't think we can do that. What? There's only enough here for one person. The only way we have to administer this is with the injection gun. And the way it functions, it uses a whole bottle each time you pull the trigger. In other words, we can't split the dose in two or something. Right. Nothing. That one bottle was it. No. Unfortunately not. No. Oh god. Just enough medicine for one dose. Only one person can be saved. Who should we give it to? Alice or Quark? Then what are we going to do? How? Do you know what immunoglobulin is? It's another name for antibodies. Some people have antibodies that can fight off Radical Six. Replicator makes it sound like it makes copies of stuff. Yeah, probably copies IG, whatever that is. Who knows, ice cream by the gallon? Uh, what?
Hold on a moment. There is a strange device in the laboratory that says IG Replicator on it. Clover and I examined it thoroughly when we were in that room. Yeah, we never could figure out what it did, though. Exactly. My question is, how do you know about it, Sigma? When was that? Probably when you were looking for Alice, right? If what he's saying is true, then we should be able to duplicate the Excelivir. That would mean we could cure Alice and Quark. Hmm. Let's go have a look then. The laboratory, right? Yeah. No time to waste. Oh, of course. I'd be happy to. So this is the lab, huh? Yes. Where's this IG replicator thing? So this can copy the Accelivir? What are we waiting for? Skip it. Just press the damn thing. Have a look. The empty vial has something in it now. And the vial Sigma used remains as it was. It does not seem to have lost any of its contents. So, it worked? Would have been pretty bad if it hadn't. What happened? You dropped one of them? What in the hell? What if you'd broken it, you idiot? Uh, guys? You see? It did break! No, the vial's fine. See? Then what the heck is going on down there? Take a look. Whoa. Really? That makes two then. Guess Kay was right after all. So there were more bombs. So it would seem. Was this here when you guys came through the first time? No, it was not. Yeah. I didn't see anything, and I looked real hard. Then somebody must have said it while we were looking for Alice. Who the hell would do that? No, not any of us. I was back in the infirmary. Quark was still out, so I was keeping an eye on him. So we shouldn't consider you a suspect. Is that right? Yeah. Quark's off the list, too. But Tenmyoji, 
You have no proof that you spent the entire time in the infirmary, do you? What? You could have quietly made your way to the laboratory, planted the bomb... That's insane! Listen to yourself! There's no way in hell I'd have left Quark all by himself to go plant a goddamn bomb! Hey, what's this thing? It looks like a... memory card. Where was it? Um, right under the bomb. It was down on the floor under the table. Could it have been put here by the same person who set the bomb? There was nothing like it here when we examined this room. <laughs> Unless it was left here intentionally, yes, I imagine so. What do you think's on it? Yeah, I guess so. So what do we do? Ten minutes remain. All players, please if no vote is recorded. Uh, guys, I think maybe we should get back to the top floor. Yeah, you're right. We've got what we came here for. Um, what should we do about the, uh, bomb? Not much we can do except leave it here. Alice said it'd be dangerous to touch them. True, but... Drop it. We can talk about the bombs later. Right now we need to take care of Alice and Quark. <laughs> right! This ought to do it. It might take a little while, but they should recover. Are they really going to be all right? Yes. The analysis I did on the files confirmed that the duplicate was real Excelivir. The original was genuine too, of course. Now that they've been treated... It's only a matter of time before the virus is eliminated. I believe so, yes. Oh man, what a relief. I was really worried. Five minutes. All right, everybody. We can be relieved later. Right now we need to get to the AB rooms and fast. Damn. Don't even have time to catch our breath. Oh, he stayed back in the infirmary. Why? Well, when we were all heading out, I noticed he wasn't doing anything. So I asked him if he was coming with us, and this is what I got. I'm still worried about Quark and Alice. I think I'll stick around and make sure they're okay. I see. That means that Fi's only opponent will be Dio. <laughs> Ugh. That's cool. Nothing to worry about. I plan to choose Ally. You know why? Because I've only got one BP. Exactly. If you chose Ally and I betrayed you, your BP would drop below zero and... Well, we know what happens then. I want to win, but I'm not that desperate. You see what I'm saying, right? <laughs> Tenmyoji and Dio are a pair. Tenmyoji only had one BP left. Since Dio said he's going to pick Ally, Fi can't really pick anything else. If she does, then Miyoji will... Um... Yeah, that's pretty much it. <sighs> Kay and I are gonna be going one-on-one -on -one too, right? Since Quark's still sleeping. That is correct. 
I've got six. As do I. If one of them can get the other to ally, and then betray that person, the betrayer will have nine points. Look, Kay, I know you don't really have any reason to trust me, but... I know. You would like us both to vote ally, yes? I yeah. I agree. If we were to both betray, then we would gain no points. We would lose nothing either, but that's hardly relevant. If both of us cooperate, then we will both gain two points, which is much more beneficial. Right. Okay, good. You're really gonna do it, right? Yes. Promise? Promise. One minute. Shit, this is bad. We need to move, now. Indeed. Shall we? Sounds good. Thirty seconds. Um, it's probably a little late to say this, but... You know, Alice is still in the infirmary, so... Yes. Ten seconds read nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. 